next day morning. Finna gas up. We're gonna take a little road trip. It's kind of a unwanted road trip, but we need it. And we pumped that 91 player. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You guys ain't following yet? Subscribe, like it up. New content's gonna be coming for sure. So we'll get back at you guys when I hit the road. Picking it back up. We're on the road right now. Somewhere in the middle of uh, Guadalajara. Who the hell cares? Nice plan. My red foreman just kicked in. <laughs> now nah, we're going out here to Mawapa right now, man. That's some bullshit. But, you know, little road trip don't hurt nobody. It was the first time I actually took the car out on a road trip. So, see how it does. See how it does on gas and everything. It's pretty peaceful, though. Music playing. Thank God for XM. There's really nothing out here, but still nice. Car is actually pretty comfortable on this little road. Suspension-wise and everything, I do need to replace driver side uh, strut. I can hear it a little bouncy here and there, but it's all right. That's why we turn wrenches on our own cars, boys. We don't pay nobody to work on our stuff. So, we'll pick it back up later on. Alright guys, so we made it out here to our destination. I said it's out in the middle of nowhere. This little building right here, believe it or not, is a county courthouse. Crazy very small little area this place is so weird so car performs badass on the little road trip no issues it was just a what good 50 miles 60 mile road trip so it's cool love it but uh yeah time to get back to vegas so like i said pretty comfortable though for a little bit of a you know little road trip that it was it was a real comfortable ride i was gonna wash it but at the same time nah i'm on the road man it's gonna get dirty again there's no really no point to it so but yeah we're gonna hit the road get back into town and go to work yeah i might pick it up a little bit on the road if i get bored so yeah Crazy out here, man. I'm actually holding the GoPro with my mouth. <laughs> I don't know how some of these YouTubers do that. I don't know how the hell some of these YouTubers do that shit, man. You must have a little secret mouthpiece mount or something, but yeah, I need to get one for my head for sure. This area is so weird. It kind of low key reminds me of Nebraska, to tell you the truth. Just at least Nebraska had more green to it. Oh Lord. So the main reason I came all the way out here, I 
I got a bullshit ass fucking ticket for my fog lights because I, I have ice blue fog lights and I guess the state trooper didn't like that. Um, and I also have a tinted license plate. Which, yeah, technically that is illegal, but you can still see perfectly fine. And it was in the fucking middle of the damn day. It was nice and sunny outside that day. And, uh, yeah. Pulled me over for that. Well, also for speeding. So, they were charging me 500 bucks. Complete total ticket. I was like, nah, I'm gonna go ahead and fight this. So, I got it dropped down to 120 bucks. Which is not bad. So, they just want to see proof that I changed out the fog lights. And the, and the fucking... And, uh... Changed out my fog lights and um, license plate cover. So I'm just gonna take off the license plate cover, take a picture of it, and then send them a mobile picture of my fog lights when there were regular lights and they're the regular halogens instead of the LED, blue LEDs that I have now. So and that should take care of that issue and just worry about the speeding ticket. Then I'm not getting no points on my record, none of that. Please no contest, fellas. That really helps out a lot. So, yeah. Now we're on our way back. Gonna go to work. So it's 1019 right now. So by the time I get there, it'll probably be like 11. And um, yeah, at least I don't miss out on that much from work. I was supposed to clock in at 8, but service manager knows what's up. So yeah, that's cool. Anyways, enough about that. So other than that, car performs phenomenal on the freaking freeway. Or highway, whatever. It's a pretty smooth ride, man. I've had about five Camaros, man. All of them were pretty smooth rides. This is probably the smoothest one, obviously, because it is newer. 2013. It's 2SS. Got all the bells and whistles. Leather interior, everything. Heated seats, all the good stuff. So, I've got a heads-up display and all that. So, But, I mean, it's, a, it's actually a pretty good highway cruiser. I'm cruising at 80 miles an hour right now at about 2,000, right under 2,000 RPMs, six gear, so. Sometimes you gotta just take these little uh, road trips, man, even though if it's sometimes, if it's a kind of a, if it's for business or it's, if it's for, you know, something that, you know, kind of sucked, you got a ticket or whatever, just go with it, man, enjoy the roads, turn on the music listen to some Van Hayden or you know some 3-6 Mafia whatever floats your boat and just cruise it just enjoy the road so look at all that crazy man it must be so peaceful to live out here I wouldn't want it. It's too it's too rural of an area, man. It's too I gotta be close to the city. I don't mind living out on the city limits, but I ain't trying to live out right here. Hell no. Low-key kind of creepy. Bet there's all kinds of rattlesnake dens out in this motherfucker too. Shit. I need to get me an ATV though so I can come out here and uh, do some stupid shit with it. <laughs> so. It's pretty cool. I'm really enjoying this little GoPro, man. It's pretty cool. I like it a lot. It's gonna come in so much handy. Oh, you see they pulled another motherfucker over there. Drop down my speed a little before you fuck around and get me. Damn, is this the same guy they had pulled over here when I passed through here? Yeah. Oh, that's another one. Damn, this was on the road. Yeah, so, alright then. We're gonna get back to this road. I'm gonna enjoy some of this music. We'll pick it back up. We're almost back home right now. See all the 
dust in this goddamn bowl of uh, the valley, pretty much. Las Vegas Valley. I know, it almost looks like fucking LA, man, with all that smog that they got up there. I never been to LA, so I'm pretty sure it looks a lot worse than this shit. But downtown Vegas over there. I don't know if you can see it. So, but like I said, car performs phenomenal, man. That's twenty three thousand dollars I ever spent in my life. I'll tell you that much. Yeah, I know it's a lot, but when you want something, you're gonna get it. So. Uh, this car had really stupid low mileage when I got it. It was thirty-six thousand. Right now we're at forty-three six oh four. Had the car eight months. I think I've done all right on mileage with it. Go back, going back to work, go back home. There's a Vegas Speedway right there. Man, I mayhem on the twenty-eighth. If you're in the Vegas area, pull up. I'll be out there. Gonna be doing some uh, my first passes ever on the track. You know, I've always stuck to the streets, but this time we're going to the track, so I'm very scared. I don't want to break anything, so I'm going to take it really light on it, just kind of get a feel for the track, and see how we go from there. I am on a regular street tire, hard tire, so it's, yeah, I'm not planning on launching the shit out of it like the way I'm doing the streets. Out of the streets, I'm doing 4K launches, man, so out there, I'm probably going to be launching like at 1,200, 1,500 at the most, slip the clutch, and let it eat, see what happens. But I for damn sure ain't doing no 4K launches. Hell no. So. Yeah. So like I said, if you're in the Vegas area, pull up. I'm going to be having a good time that day. This weather's getting real nice. It is 59 degrees right now. All this week is supposed to be in the 70s. So. We should be alright. It's not going to be too hot out there, you know. You ever been to Vegas, you know how hot it can get out here. Stupid hot. So it'll be like 110 outside. You come outside all the way to the track, it's like at 120 or so. Yeah, so it's a, it gets pretty hot. But, um, yeah, we're back. So I'll see y'all later. All right, we are back home. Oh, oh, oh nice little drive. So yeah, those are the blue lights that they try to get me for. Uh, yeah, so they're not even on crazy blue, man, but they're just hating. It's all good, though. It happens. So, we're back at home. I think I'm just going to take the rest of the day off today. Got some things we got to handle, too, so, you know, fuck it. It is what it is. So, we'll see what else is cracking later on tonight. I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.